Hi everyone, this is Peter. Today I want to introduce is the PD Movie Remote Air Mini. So you will ask, okay, what's the difference in between the Remote Air Pro, Remote Air 2 and also Remote Air Mini? Okay, the biggest difference is Remote Air Mini is fully controlled by the apps. Okay, so how to set it up? Let's talk about how to set up the motor first. Okay, so the motor setup is very easy. So you, okay, I'm already set up like two of them. And then, okay, this one is the receiver. So you will see they are, the connector is slightly different than the others, which you will put the remote, uh, the antenna on here. So the setup is so easy. So you see the hole here. Uh, so you pull onto, onto the rod and then you align your uh, gear onto the, uh, onto the gear onto the flat on, um, on, your, on your lens. So lock it like this. Okay, fine. So then, okay, I daisy chain it. So what I need to do is connect this with the limo to the next one. And then on the second, and then I do the same on the third one. Okay. Like this. Okay. At the end, I just connected the power connector, the cables with the batteries. So now the motor is set up. And also you find out like maybe the first motor, the Bluetooth light is actually in red color. That means it's disconnected. So, uh, okay, on the next step, you need to open your remote air apps. So the, this is an app. So that means any iOS system which can download this app and then use with the Bluetooth and then you can use it. So that means no matter on the iPhone, iPod or even the iPad, especially like the 12 inch iPad Pro and then you can still use it, I, I believe, okay. So that means, okay, what you need to do is remember, before you open the apps, open your Bluetooth first because they are connected with the Bluetooth. So, okay, switch it on, the apps, Okay, then you will find out, okay, the, um, the Bluetooth uh, indicator is actually flashing. At the same time, the motors is in green color. So that means now they are communicate with each other. So how can I align it? It's pretty easy. On the focus down there, there is, is uh, uh, auto buttons. So you press the auto buttons. So then, okay, all the motors which attach with the system and then will align at the same time. So it's pretty easy and pretty fast too. Okay, once you do that, the whole system is being aligned. Okay, so most of the fun okay, not most, all the functions on the re on this app is the same as what we introduced on the Remote Air Pro. So the only I want to point out like two main like maybe uh, features which I want to like maybe uh, 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 talk about. First is okay, for example, if you only got one motors, and then I don't want to have like maybe a lot of information which is not necessary in this in the screen, and then how can I take it out? It's pretty easy. For example, I, I only want to control the zoom. The other, I don't. I only have the zoom uh, uh, motor. The other, I don't have. What I need to do is, okay, un, un, un highlight this, double tap the iris, double double tap the uh, the the focus. Okay, so then, okay, I will actually just like minimize the uh, unnecessary items on the side. So which makes the, uh, the, the particular channels is much bigger. So that means now I'm more easy to control everything. So that is something which maybe is very easy to operate because it is an apps. So you can control or and customize yourself. And the other thing I want to talk about is the electronic um, zoom in with a timer. So what you need to do is, for example, like, okay, uh, now, okay, I got a control onto the uh, focus. And then what I need to do is, for example, I set the AB point first. Okay. Then on, on the AB point up here, and then you will see a time. You press the time. Okay. So now it will give you, okay, you can press a number, for example, like three seconds, 15 seconds, like maybe 10 seconds, something else. Okay. I press three. Okay, so okay. So then you will see the timer is now changing to free. So that means from the A point to the B point, the time is actually talking about three seconds. At the same time, you will see there is an arrow there. So if you got like two arrows pointing up and down, that means, okay, they will zoom in and zoom out all the time. So what's happening? They will do the zoom in, hold for a few seconds, and then they will do a zoom out hold for a few seconds and then do it again and again. So, but if you want to do just like only a zoom in or maybe a zoom out, what you need to do is double tag the time and then you will see the arrow is only point into one direction. 
So, but because I want to show you more dramatically, so I want to have two arrows. So once you do that, everything has been set, what you need to do is just press the timer. Then you will see the whole, the whole indicators on the apps will actually moving. At the same time, and then you will see the, um, um, uh, the, the, the lens uh, zoom will also do the same time. So it is very good because you even you do the touch screen, you never ever get a perfectly smooth full zoom on all the times. So that is make your life much easier and also it's easy to operate. So if you want to stop that, okay, it's easy, just like stop this and then okay, so you can reset it all. So how easy you can use this with an app system. So if you want to know more about like this uh, remote air mini, please visit BD Movie and also ANS website.